Greetings, it's Jim Pecora, a director of the Mica Mine Schoolhouse, and we're in a low light setting because I'm going to demonstrate the use of UV lights, long wave, 365 nanometer UV lights. Um, and I just like to read from this website, Nature's Rainbows. This is what uh, they published uh, a short time ago. By now, the fluorescent mineral community has heard of the con Convair flashlight that has taken our hobby by storm. It is its technology is significant. It is the most significant, sorry, new technology to hit our hobby in years, even decades, based on a high-powered 365 nanometer, nanometer UV LED plus a filter. It is providing field collectors with an intense, cost-effective light, which amazes everyone that tries it. I want to show you what the pricing difference is, because if you Google 365 nanometer, or if you Google long-wave flashlight, or... Um, UV light, you're going to come up with these under $10 items on Amazon.com. And I'm going to show you what happens in using one of these. These two here look identical, but there was a, a name on this particular one and it came with a little bit of a um, uh, card. So most UV lights are made for man-made items that I have here. Okay, this is a shot glass made of glass. The other things are made of plastic. This is antique uranium glass but in here this should turn orange and we don't see anything these minerals like spodumene i mean sodalite will do well rubies will do well but these other ones are all colorless except for the last one under these cheap lights so again this one's a little bit better you can actually see that they have two different I bought, bought them at different times, and, and it, it's just very confusing to buy these lights. These teeny little ones. Um, now, the next two here, again, look identical. But there's a $30 one, and there's a $50 one. The difference is the $50 one has a lens, okay, a UV lens. Let's try first the 30 okay, the man-made fluoresce well, uranium glass, no pink, about the same as the under $10 one. Now let's try the one with the filter. Man-made fine, uranium, nothing, nothing. You haven't seen this yet. And very, very poor performance, but you paid over $50 for this with a filter. You can't believe what you... Now it did come with a nice little carrying case, but again, you cannot believe what um, you're being told. Back to under 50 or 60, are these particular fluorescents. Now I invested in these to uh, resell them and it actually turns out that they do okay and they're very reasonable, the man-made's, and it's the first time we're starting to see the beautiful orange that's in, within inside of this geode, the calcite, but it gets better. So let me show you with this one. Again, you're starting to see it. Weak, weak on these other minerals, almost nothing coming up here. Again, everything does well on man-made. Before I show you the conveyor, let's show you a black light bulb. This is put out by Philips. It says you black, black light. Um, and again, it's made for a little bit of activation on the man-maids and nothing else. Now, we, we also have this light here, which was given to me as a UV light. It's blue. It does nothing, maybe a teeny bit on the man-maids, no minerals. Again, you know, I've tried them all, that's what I want you to know. You know, here's two four-foot fluorescent um, black lights that you would find at a club. Again, the man-maids do great. The minerals are illuminating. Some of our pendants that we sell will illuminate with this. But basically, this is just the white of the paper, the labels that you're seeing so well. Um, so if you want to get any of this information, go online and I have a, um, a couple of graphics that you can uh, see. Again, this Convair does not compare to these price ranges. It compares to lights that are selling at $400 to $500, dollars $600 for um, leak detection. We're selling this for $94.95 and we have a very limited quantity. So here we go. Man-made, vibrant, uranium glass, vibrant. Look at the orange in there. And we're in daylight conditions. The sun is starting to come in the window just across from us. And what we didn't see before is these middle minerals. Look at how rich they are. This one here is not known to be fluorescent. 
In the, in the record books, look up Kyanite. This is the most intense long wave, long wave flashlight that you can take out in the field and it illuminates all different kinds of rocks that no other light will. That's what I wanted to share with you. Thanks so much and have a great day.